Okay, I finished up uh, arranging the cables. Doing that I discovered something which is not okay. And I will have to return this main board. Because there's other ones, they have different revisions. And for this one, revision 1.5 and 1.6 do not have the ARGB ports. Here, there should be ARGB ports. And somewhere here, they are missing. Because of that I cannot use this for RGB. Anyway, I like very much this case, which has everything that you need to arrange the cables and also things to, to stop the dust from coming into the computer, which is very nice. There is one here, one on the front and one below from where the power adapter is getting the air. For LEDs, you will have to join me in the other episode. There is another reason I want to return this mainboard. It doesn't have port for USB-C. See this case has USB-C port here and this is the USB-C cable. There is no place on the mainboard to put it. The other mainboard that I will buy is ATX. This one is M ATX. 
but same speed for RAM, PCI Express 404, the graphics adapter. The only thing that the other one doesn't have, Wi-Fi. However, you can easily find Wi-Fi which can be plugged on USB port or on, yeah, another bad thing about it. You do not have access to the other PCI Express port and there is also a small PCI slot which is covered by the graphics adapter. So if you want to buy this type of mainboard with a big graphics adapter, you have to remember you will not be able to use any other port. Everything is covered by the graphics adapter. Okay, enough with that. See you in the next episode.